Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be talking about how to use Variety to change your wallpaper automatically. So I've got Variety open, and please check the description because we have the command on how to install this tool on your Linux distribution of choice. So if you open up the tool, it'll open in a system tray, and you can just click Preferences. So by default, this button here is not checked. I would check this box, but please understand that it's experimental. So if you want to avoid NSFW altogether, all it's going to require some ratings. And that means image, report NSFW, or, or stuff like that. Anyway, so by default, the wallpaper changes every 30 minutes or every 5 minutes or something like that. I find that very annoying. So I'm going to set it to days, and I'll set it to one day. So every day it changes. And I'm also going to check this box here to make sure it starts when it turns on. And then over here under images, you can go through and you can decide where you want to get individual wallpapers. By default, it's just going to go through the the backgrounds of the uh, of the dis of the desktop and the distribution that you use. In my case, I'm recording this on XFCE, so it shows up here. You know, there's also the Bing photo of the day. And that's all starts up. And you can just go up here and click Next and swap through to whatever wallpaper you'd like. And let's find a good one. So this is a pretty good wallpaper. I like this one, so I'm going to stick with it. It will download all of the wallpapers to this configuration directory. And there's even other settings like effects, where if you want an oil painting effect, you can do that. I don't really see the point of that. There are a bunch of different effects that may or may not work. It really depends on uh, image magic. Uh, like here, this, doing this one here, we'll set it to a heavy blur. Um, and as you can see, this just makes it a blurry image. There's also pointillism. And you can even have quotes to your, to your stuff too. So we can have pointillism and we can have this quote here. We can change the placement. So if I want it at the bottom on the left and the vertical position on the bottom as well like there's a bunch of options for it you can also show the clock and that will show the time I've got it all messed up but it looks very very interesting it's a it's a huge addition to just the normal boring wallpaper stuff. There's also social media, which is not important, and you can even sync between desktops, which we won't be doing in this video, but it is possible. And there are a lot of different settings. So in this article, I also discuss how to do this uh, wallpaper changing on KDE Plasma. I'm not gonna do that in this video because most of the desktop environments can use Variety. Variety is the most important thing here because we can use it on XFCE like I'm doing. You can use it on GNOME, on Mate, on LXDE, on pretty much everything. The only thing that really it can't work on is KDE. So if you are a KDE user and you're looking to do this uh, automatic wallpaper changing, it's a built-in feature. Please check the article in the description below and it will explain roughly about the same thing. It won't be as neat as the, uh, the quotes or the clock, but it's about the same for wallpaper changing. So once again, go to the general settings and look around here. And this is basically all that you really need to know is just the settings for the time. And if you want to add your own wallpaper, click the add button, click folders and browse for it. And I'm using a screenshot of a Twitch stream for my wallpaper. Uh, I hope this video was informative guys. I have to get going, but uh, I will see you in the next video.